Americans' families are bearing a grave load from the falling houses prices, mortgage delinquencies, foreclosures, and a weak economy. It is important that they are not crushed under the weight of the wrong mortgages. The AMT was supposed to rise with inflation. So back in the 1960s, when the AMT was originally proposed, um, the inflation was a lot lower. So the highest bracket of American uh, workers, or yeah, the highest income bracket of American workers, was actually much lower. And in the past, I think it's 20 years, Congress has taken steps to um, adjust the AMT periodically to inflation. So what they want to do now is they want to patch it so it adjusts more easily to inflation. Also for American corporations outside of the United States, where American where these corporations might be forced to pay a tax rate to the countries where they are located in, say China, Japan, or Saudi Arabia. In Saudi Arabia, as I recall, the tax rate is 85%, I think, correct? 85%. <coughs> so in addition to that, companies like Exxon Mobil, uh, actually no, Shell's a Dutch company, um, would have would have to pay um, an additional 35% to, Ameri um, to America as opposed to, say, taking advantage of the loopholes which have been so generously provided. Since 1981, standard Republican fiscal, fiscal policy has been increasing the gross federal debt to GDP by nearly 2% per year. However, at, for Obama, this is to um, hold a constant rate of gross federal debt to GDP. We need to stay competitive in the world. We can't have all of our jobs being shipped off. And I know you've said that there are, um, that Obama's going to have incentives and also disincentives for shipping jobs overseas. But this, this carrot and stick thing, you know, people don't respond well to that. If you actually look at the taxes that big corporations pay, it, it can vary from anywhere to an average tax rate to a very, very low tax rate globally. Um, and so what Obama proposes doing is closing the loopholes that allow us to pay such low tax rates in reality when they look so high. Um, and so what that would mean would be not allowing companies that keep their money out of the country, although they're based in the country, the companies that keep that money out of the country and therefore keep it untaxed. Um, have that money be taxable, um, and then in, and then have that paid for companies in the country having lower tax rates. 